Namaste, welcome all of you. Uh, today I would like to continue with solution related to conditional trigonometric identities. As you can see the condition on the screen that if a plus b plus c is equal to pi, you need to prove sin 2a plus sin 2b minus sin 2c is equals to 4 cos a into cos b into sin c on the right side. So as usual, I would like to take left hand side for this question and let's begin the solution. So um, sin 2a plus sin 2b minus sin 2c, this I have copied from the question from left hand side. And then uh, to move to the next step, we take these two parts and we compare this with sin c plus sin d and if uh, any trigonometric uh, terms are given in the form of sin c plus sin d that can be written as 2 sin c plus d by 2 into cos c minus d by 2 so writing sin 2a plus sin 2b in the similar form we get 2 sin 2a plus 2b by 2 into cos 2a minus 2b by 2. Here you can see that uh, this 2a is kept in place of c and 2b is kept in place of d if we compare with the formula and then this sin 2c can be written as 2 sin c into cos c as it comes from this formula that you have learned in your class. And then uh, again to move uh, to the next step, uh, we take uh, 2 common from the angles. So taking 2 common a and b. B remains inside the bracket and as there is 2 in denominator we can cancel this denominator and numerator and it remains only a plus b as angle and that we can write in this way so this can be written as sin a plus b and following the same rule we can write this as cos a minus b and again 2 sin c into cos c is repeated so let's move to the next step and in the next step we will convert this sin a plus b in the form of angle c and that can be done from the condition that we have been provided like a plus b plus c is equal to pi a plus b can be written as pi minus c taking the c on the right side and then if we keep sign on the both sides that can be written as sign c so to write sign c we need to know one more thing that is the cast rule if you remember the cast rule that whenever the angle lies in between 90 degree and 180 degree as we can see here 180 degree minus c that means the angle lie lies in this quadrant second quadrant and here following the cast rule sine will be positive that's why we can write sine a plus b as sin c plus sin c so uh, in the same way we have written here sin c and in the second part also we can see 2 sin c so from these two parts we will take 2 sin c common and then uh, we'll move to the next step like 2 sin c that comes common and cos a minus b minus cos c will be the remaining factors in the previous step and after this again uh, following the similar way that we have done for sin a plus b 
वी कैन कन्वर्ट माइनस कस सी इन द फॉर्म अफ कस ए प्लस बी दैट यू कैन से हेयर बट देर इज अ लिटल चेंज हेयर वी हेव रिटर्न माइनस एंड दैट इज वाई अगेन दैट इज बिकज अफ द कास्ट रूल सिंस द एंगल इज बिट्विन नाइन्टी डिग्री एंड हंड्रेड एटी डिग्री बट एकोर्डिंग टू द कास्ट रूल only sin and cos can be positive here so cos will be negative that's why we have written minus here so minus cos c can be written as cos a plus b as we can see here so that's why we have written plus cos a plus b in place of minus cos c now moving to the next step again we can convert this whole part into a formula that we need to remember that cos a minus b plus cos a plus b is equals to 2 cos a into cos b this is also the formula that we need to keep in our mind while doing this type of questions so now we can change this whole part as 2 cos a into cos b so doing that we have 2 cos a into cos b here 2 sin c is already in the question now in the next step multiplying this 2 and this 2 the product will be 4 and cos a and cos b will come from the second part and sin c from the first part and this is what we want on the right side hence l h s is equals to r h s proved so i hope you are clear with the processes that i have followed here if there is any suggestion you want to provide then please and do it thank you very much for watching the video